Hello and welcome back to uh, the next installment of Band of Comrades where we are still um, pursuing the retreating Germans. Although now I think we can actually get some enemy casualties going here. Like, more than before at least. Especially with the heavy machine guns in, um, in support now. I think I need to move up these guys more, because they don't... I think it's the bushes or something, although they're also covering and this guy got hit. Um. Yeah, Germans are really being pinned down now, I have um, fire superiority, so I need to y use that to move up my scouts with their submachine guns. And these guys. These guys are also still there. Oh, careful there. That's my spotting rounds, I think. Or the German spotting rounds, which I don't hope. That should be a nice firing position to maybe get some retreaters. And there come the scouts, so what's left of them? Spotting round still falling. Now these seem pretty suppressed. You can't see anything. Well, that's a rise on the ground. Maybe I can use that. Ah, oh, apparently our artillery is ranged in, so they can start harassing over there. Although I'm not sure how many retreating people they will actually catch. What? Camp much? Well, they are dead. I did not expect them there. They, they just camped behind that house. They were nobody saw them. They actually disappeared. Like they didn't have the the spotting icon left. That was really weird. Yeah, got a casualty as well. Ah, oh, it's squad leader, damn it. Yeah, retreat, that's a good idea. Yeah, and run into that motor barrage while you're at it. 
Although I think to be honest I kind of jumped the gun on the mortars. Uh, if I had used them a bit later when more people were, were retreating her, it would have been better. Bringing up the heavy machine guns now. Lots of submachine gunning. But on the other side as well. That's a bit risky, but... Want to take out these guys finally? What? They're always doing that. What the fuck? And he throws a grenade. <laughs> okay, our grenadiers were apparently a bit better. <laughs> that was a weird situation. Okay, finally that guy's done. Okay, but these are taking our fire from several directions. That position is now the annoying one. Okay, keeping up the pressure. I think they are near their breaking point, at least in this area. Because they have lost so many people and their, their whole position is untenable to begin with. It's just that they, they don't surrender, it's a problem. Yeah, that's good. between a rock and a hard place, Mo uh, mortar barrage and my guys. Well, they are stubborn, I give them that. Shoot back, please. Oh, better. Okay. I have the feeling that resistance in this part is basically exterminated. So next up, the bridges. That sounds like a light machine gun. Where's that coming from? They can't spot it. Whoa. It's close though. Or or is it? Or maybe it's coming from over there. So then maybe the mortar already suppressed them a bit, but hmm. 
maybe from the house spotting is a bit easier. So many dead Germans, Jesus Christ. Where's that machine gun shooting from? It's pretty near. I think it's here. Which begs the question why aren't they spotting it? Too suppressed? Maybe I will be able to see it from the south. So there's more guys here guarding the bridge. I would really, I would really like to be able to spot that annoying mystery machine gun here. Whoa! Still no spot on it, huh? By the way, over here, I flanked all all the way up to here with this platoon, so I will soon attack this shed. I think these Germans have developed some kind of cloaking device. I mean, it must... Oh, maybe it's coming from back here, actually. Yeah, that's it. It's coming from the south. do about that. Probably taking this position to be honest. hard to get an angle on that house because it's on the hill behind the little dip in the ground. Aha, hmm. uh -huh, we finally found it and yeah, it's a heavy machine gun and they're reloading. So we can get that heavy machine gun somehow. Uh, more in there than I had hoped.
No, you stood. need to get the heavy machine guns on that. I think my artillery barrage was just ended. Or maybe now I can um, move it into a more um, focused position. Ah, crap from there. Fast coming from there as well. Okay, over here I might be able to get some fire superiority going now, because I'm closer now, and... That's something that you might sometimes have to do with the Russians, just brute force it. Because generally speaking, um... Each of the different... Ah, crap. Each of the different uh, nations in this game kind of plays differently. And the Russians play a bit like a sledgehammer, where you, where sometimes you just have to take the problem head on and use numbers as well as overwhelming close range firepower to get what you want. Like here, these guys are now suppressed. And what I also don't know is that my scouts are flanking them here. I hope this works out somewhat well. I'm very close now, so that's good. Let's crack this position. Ah, they're fleeing! Nice. And mow down. Are the others fleeing as well? Looks like it. Yep, yep, they're, they're running. They're probably, uh, probably trying to get across the fridges now. That's good. Especially because that's the heavy machine gun team, I think. There's also still people in here. I just noticed that apparently we bypassed Germans in the forest, which is new to me. So I don't know what I will do about that. Let's see what they do, I'll probably retreat. Now this position is really getting annoying.
What a chaotic battle. And these guys are still fleeing. A stellar machine gun. Although I don't think they deployed it, they're probably just firing it in my direction. I wonder what... What in the actual hell? Like, what? That many people were in there. How can I... How could I miss those? Well, I mean, they're retreating, obviously. Well, what do I do about that, actually? I don't only have the recon troops in this position. Although they are, of course, completely out of position, and my snipers are actually still here. Um, yeah, good luck, mate. Well, this is an unexpected turn of events. Well, at least my sniper now has a shooting gallery here. <laughs> Look at this. Okay, I'm switching troops over to deal with this um, breakout attempt, I guess. I mean, these uh, snipers here are screwed, but I hope they can kill a few and maybe pin them down and confuse them. Yeah, they've still got some. Mm, these are out of position. I wish I had moved them here f f sooner, but I thought it was just a few guys, or maybe like a sniper team or something, that I had missed. And these guys are also running now. No, this guy has an SDG-44. That's actually... One of the first times I've ever seen one of those in this game, they're fairly rare. In the Adens game, you have a lot of them. Jesus Christ. Yeah, now they're going to ground here. Hmm. You know, the ironic thing is that the retreating Germans are actually taking the same route my flanking force did. Don't know if that's ironic, but kind of ironic. Moving over more and more troops here now. Because I kinda want to destroy that breakout troop. Anyway, I think we'll end the video here. It's been going on long enough. But yeah, this will be an interesting third video. Anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed this, and as always, uh, thanks for watching, and have a nice day.